What is going on guys, King Hammer here, back from another video. This is Infected on World War II. Now this is going to be fun because I've actually already played a little bit of it. Because I had a different type of video planned out, but this will work. So far what I've played, I think it's pretty cool. I think it's cool the fact that like, this this was an older game mode in different Call of Duties and now it's just being, it's being brought back to this. I like it, I think it's fun. It's definitely one of those things that you could get on with a group of friends and just freaking, man, that would be a lot of fun, but I don't have any friends. It's about to be lit, it's gonna be fun. If it would ever load, you know, that'd be kind of nice. That's one thing I wish that they had optimized better for PC is the loading because it takes like a minute or two to get into matches. And then it kind of does this type of stuff where it spectates for a second and then goes and like, see, literally I started this match and everything, but this guy's over here glitching around. I'm probably about to crash the game, honestly, and they're, we're already winning somehow. <laughs> Come on, you could put a little more effort into that, you know. I'd say it's my computer, but like, probably not. I don't have like greatest, nicest computer ever, but... You know, it could at least load into games. Like, that'd be nice. Here we go. Come on, people. I want to kill somebody. I don't know where the, they would even spawn. <laughs> We're all over the map. I don't see any of them. I like how I get points for surviving. Surviving against what? I haven't seen anything. <laughs> oh, you know how creepy that would be? Imagine, okay? Imagine there's like a game where you're running around and you just get points for surviving, but there's nothing that you're actually surviving against. It's just like a PTSD game. <laughs> we won. We won. I didn't kill anybody. No, but like think of how cool that would be like you're sitting there running around like this huge open area and there's a bunch of creepy like okay if anyone takes this idea you know, i'd be mad or not be mad actually it'd be kind of cool if someone can develop this into a real game but like you're running around this big map okay and there's a bunch of like mannequins set up and they're just there but you get points for surviving it could be kind of like a weeping angels type of thing where it's whenever you're not looking they're moving but they're actually not <laughs> and you're just surviving <laughs> Yo, I actually had a question for you guys. Okay, so I like playing Call of Duty a lot. I, I play it pretty pretty often. Not very much, as you can tell by my rank wherever I'm standing right here. 29. I don't play it every day or something like that. I want to play some other games. I want to play some more stuff. I think I might start doing some sort of uh, play like Let's Plays. Not on like old, old Let's Plays, but like on older games. Because I've actually, I have like 20 or 30 games that I've bought through Steam and just other platforms, like just in general, I have a lot of games and most of them are single player games like Portal, Portal 2, Bioshock Infinite, Watch Dogs is the one that I'm mainly thinking about here. Oh hey, this one spawned me in immediately, that's kind of cool. But I have all of these games and I've, I've been wanting to play a lot of them recently and I was thinking like, what if I did some playthroughs on it? Like, would you guys watch that type of stuff? I don't know. I mean, I know that they're older games, but if I can make them, I'll probably do it without face cam because I think straight commentary with gameplay is better for those types of scenarios because you're not like my face cam right now is taking up some space on the top right corner of the actual game or of the video that you're seeing at least. But I think for playthroughs it would be kind of cool and if i could get it consistent enough and if you guys liked it i could maybe start a schedule where i could upload like i could record a bunch of parts day after day after day and then upload them every day i don't know just let me know in the comments let me know what you think because i think that would be i don't know i'd like to do that and i'll probably end up doing that even if you guys do or don't like it because i'm sure someone will why does this seem like it's a very dead game mode <laughs> i'm being serious like i haven't shot a single bullet in the two matches that i've played crap I don't know what that did. What is going on? Is there one infected person and that's what we're all up against? Why? Why is that even the case? They should spawn it half and half and look we're about to win. We are about to win and there's only one infected but this is stupid. <laughs> this is such a dumb game mode. I'd rather just go play zombies. Wow look at that. We won. Holy crap. No way. 10v1 and we won? This is what it's like whenever you don't put care into a game. You don't even care about the fact that scenarios like a 10v1 can happen that should not be the case in this it should be half and half and then they can come and change us onto their side and it would be like one survivor versus like 10 people this is so stupid <laughs> okay like listen if we needed this game mode in the game in order to like do anything different sorry i hit the mic there but if we needed the game mode like if we could progress differently through this game mode that would be cool but i'm pretty sure you only get xp like regular unranked xp and on top of that, I didn't even shoot a single bullet in the two matches that I've played. They, it wasn't intense. There was nothing that was like, oh gosh, like, look at this. I'm going to play one more and see what happens. But like, oh, I hope this one's better. You guys know what's bothering me lately? What's been kind of weird? I've basically been doing a lot of commentaries, just regular me commentating over gameplay type of stuff and not like this, like live commentaries. And it's just, I don't know why, but I had some sort of like nervousness whenever I sat down to record this. Like I sat down and I was like, all right, let's make a video. And I sat here and I was like, why am I, why am I scared to record? 
Okay, but actually though, if anyone has any information on how this is supposed to go, what's actually supposed to happen besides uh, one person changing all of us because that's literally almost an impossible task. Oh, look at the chances on that. Bam. This actually isn't that bad. <laughs> okay, I can see how this part of it can be fun, but like for the other people when there's not very many like there's it's a 1v10 situation and those people were afk that I did like this guy watch him dead This dude dead. Why is everyone afk? What's even the point? <laughs> it just seems very bothersome to me It seems like this is supposed to be better than it actually is and they probably had some sort of hyped up reveal trailer that they did But it was really just like nothing and we don't have any like special abilities I mean, I think we run a little bit faster. We don't jump any higher and we don't like like i'm not saying like we need all that stuff but be kind of cool these guys are just sitting here look at them they're not even no one is moving nobody is moving i'm not being shot at uh i don't think anyone's even seen me running around this is the most dead game mode i've ever seen in the call of duty actually scratch that i think there was a different one that was in ghost something like that that was just so terribly unplayed that it was like i think they've removed it in one of the updates and no one even noticed i don't know which one it was but nobody said a thing about it and there wasn't anything like no one was devastated by the fact that it was removed i don't have some sort of special abilities do i there's not something i'm supposed to, i'm not supposed to like get any these crates aren't mine. I can't get them. They're, they're for the survivors. If there are any, I don't even know where everyone's at. I don't, if I knew the spawns on this map. Oh, hey, look at this dude. Hey, there we go, man. You know what? I congratulate him. He deserves that clap. He deserved that kill, too. Look at him. He's sitting there. Oh, God, there's time. Okay. Okay, that's a little bit different. There's a time limit, so I have to get... That's definitely been longer than seven seconds. I'm pretty sure the match has ended. Notice, no network connection detected. What? Did I just lose internet? The moment it starts to get even a little bit intense, I'm disconnected from the server. What are the chances? I don't think that hardpoint would be any different. I don't think that it would be any more intense. I honestly think if this was what we needed, it could have at least been put in the zombies playlist. I don't know. I'm going to try some more of this later, like in a couple of days or so and see maybe if more people are on it or if it's even taken out of the game because I don't know. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to drop a like, subscribe, and comment down below. And also, I will probably have a video on something called Reload Focus out soon. It's one of the sponsors of Kings, and they are sending me a package to test out some of their some of their product. It's like a it's an energy drink formula, or not a formula. It's just an energy drink, and I'll probably have a video out on it. If not, I will buy more and make a video on it because right now I kind of want to see what it's like just to use. I'll probably have something out like that. Uh, anyways, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one. Don't play infected. Peace.